just wanted to take a quick video of uh, everything that's involved in making just one beam, one knee brace. First, you need a tenon for the top plate, a housed mortise for the beam made with uh, the beam saw, a lot of handwork done with the chisel, and the uh, mortiser right here. Uh, that is for the uh, support cross beam. These are the knee braces, which uh, if I told you how much work is involved in making these, um, it makes my head spin. And I wanted to show you, this is the knee brace mortise, which again is one of the hardest uh, mortises to make because there's about four different angles and many, many, many measurements. And what you have to do, and I'm going to show you real quick before I shut the video off, the knee brace goes in here like this, and mortised, and then at a 45, and it's housed at the same time. Let's see if we can focus it in here. So it sits just like that, and then it's pinned right about, I can't really show you, but right about here pinned or you could put two pins uh, of maple and that I'm going to back off so you can sort of see uh, and then that of course there's going to be a beam going uh, where's my finger from there up to there obviously going straight across and that will be mortised as well and the tricky part is getting all the angles right so that when you put it all together it's 90 degrees and uh, it's incredible. And then, of course, there's a mortise right at the end, or a tenon, I should say, to go into the foundation. So, just to give you an idea of how much work's involved, it takes about two hours to do just one post because of all the measurements. In, but it's absolutely bloody gorgeous <laughs> when it's all done. And uh, it's all put together with no glue, no nails, no screws, all pegs. And um, what gives the frame the strength is this shoulder right here right everything doesn't move and of course with the tenons and pegged and here it's very important to house your shoulders these are called housings and then these are called up here shoulders and the shoulders are housed which give it all its strength and then the pins of course that go right here hold everything together and that is a mortise and tenon, 45 degree knee brace, post and beam.